It is, uh, it's just the perfect day today. Sensational weather. It's a day to be doing K's. Question is, should I keep going? Yes. <laughs> what a legend. What a legend. You are you are a first class madman. Giving it a go, first day flipping. <laughs> That's your first day. Yeah. Jesus, oh, well, man. Give it a go. That's so gutsy. <laughs> Almost crashed it. I'm shaking too. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Did he nearly crash? No. I almost, looked, almost. Like, it looked pretty good to me. <laughs> <laughs> Did you almost crash? What was it? Oh, the... almost like kept going. Yeah. Really. Back wheel and just slipped up. But it's all right. I'm alive. You know, Sh Sean and I were uh, were rolling around the park, just thinking we were awesome, just going, you know, up on the berms and stuff like that. And then out of nowhere, that BMX dude just does this full backflip, and I was like, mate, people are next level. Like, you think you're good? There's always someone way better. Alright, so Sean and I have ridden about three kilometres, but we're, uh, no, nah, probably a little bit more than that. But we're going to a little cafe called Coffee Peddler. I'm wondering if they uh, are, coffee, uh, are cyclist friendly with a name like Coffee Peddler. They're peddling coffee or they're, they're cool on cyclists? I think it actually was more with the peddling coffee. Uh, okay. Ask a mirror though, yeah. Okay. I actually don't like red at all, but. Um... When I saw this frame, I just fell in love with it. The sort of candied red. Um, yeah, it harks back to that really great, you know, everything's gone stealth now, which is great. It looks fantastic. How do you find the uh, seat, the, the uh, cell SMP? Uh, yeah, good, good. I think it's just, I think it just needs that adjustment. And then the idea is that it rotates your hips the right yeah. angle. And when it's, when it's spot on, it's really comfy. Yeah. Do you ever get the van out? Yeah. Or does yeah, it stay in out. there? No, we go out. We go out, but um, it's great now. There's more of a following that knows we're here. Yeah. Um, so like this morning, you know, big bunches of riders come in. Yeah, it's great. Hannah's showing me how to do Pilates. So she, Hannah does Pilates. Bar. Bar Pilates, is yeah. it? What have I got to do to make this happen? Go like that. Yeah. Into your plie. What? The plie. All right. All right. Yeah. And go down as low as you can. Yeah. And then just wrap your knees forward. Okay. Like that. And what does that do? Oh, you'll feel it. Do you feel your inner thighs? Hey, give me a magazine, will you? What are you not doing? Right. <laughs> All right, Hannah bought a bike rack thing for me to store two bikes on. So it's a pole, it's this thing. It goes from the floor to the roof. And um, it's gonna go over where my trainer used to be. My trainer is now in the study where I do all my videos. So you guys are gonna watch us try and put this bad boy up. So it's got a quick release lever here that you pull. Extend the thing to the top, and then you can tighten it up down here. All right, job done. The bikes are up on the wall. Uh, I'm not sure if they'll be staying there, to be honest with you. <laughs> it's really overbearing. <laughs> You hate it, don't you? I do, to be honest. Yeah, could we try lowering them, maybe? Yeah, like maybe. Yours sits on the ground and then mine goes as close as possible. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. A little bit further, a little bit further. That's all we've got. Yeah, there. Just leave it there. We haven't got much choice, do we? No. Because we've got bikes. So we could put them in the spare room with you. No, man, I've got 
light boxes and all sorts of things going on there. I don't, I've got no more room in there. That pole's not straight out, it's too far over to the left too. It's not. If you stand directly in front of the pole, it's straight. The pole itself is so intuitive and easy to use that regardless of how this looks in the house, the pole is outstanding, okay? Uh, we bought it, Hannah actually bought it as a Christmas birthday present for her. <laughs> but, um, but it's called Bike Hand. Is that the name of the brand? Bike Hand? Yeah, it must be. Yeah. Bike Hand. So where'd you buy it? Um, online from, oh God, I can't remember now. Cycles Direct or something like that, or Cycle Deals. Okay. I'll have to double check that. Do you want me to double check that? Yep. Cyclingdeal.com.au. It had $100 off. How much was it all up? Um, it was $180 down from $280. Okay. It may be overcast and slightly cool, but it is perfect weather for wearing this outfit. Good morning. Good morning. How are we? Am I late? Merry Christmas. Happy <laughs> Am I late? What time is it? We having a coffee first or what? <laughs> All right, Nick, lead it out, mate. On the front, good squad. Let's do this. Thanks for the ride team, appreciate it, good work, good job, fist, fist bump, fist bump. <laughs> Alright legends, so a couple of fun days for us, uh, I really appreciate all the crew rocking up and doing the Christmas ride. Um, it is now the 27th of December, I want to thank you guys for a great year, Hannah and I sat down and filmed a recap video for our year. Uh, I thought it was pertinent to have Hannah involved because she was a big part of the vlogs this year. So I'm editing that now. That hopefully will be up before the end of the year and that'll be my last video for 2017. But uh, I'm going to finish this video with some slow-mo footage of the AeroPress coffee maker thing that Hanny bought me for my birthday Christmas. So uh, here's some slow-mo footage of me making coffee with this. Mm -hmm.